and we're back from more dire growth more dire growth let's get into the scene here this is where we left off in the last video we thought out some meat fed a wolf and i found a fishy felix uh bonus I don't know what you call it, medallion or whatever, that uh, looks like it's going to unlock something if I find the other one. So uh, I have to keep an eye out for something crazy. Alright, so I'm back for more of uh, me fumbling around here. Uh, I did tweak the resolution, resolution to be a little bit bigger, but this is relatively tiny on my screen. But that's okay, it's all part of the fun of sharing and caring. Bullwhip. So what's considered a book stack? That is. We had one of those already. A hoof. A staple gun. Sunglasses. Who's wearing them? Haha. Tusk and some dynamite. I have a very distinct uh, vision of what a staple gun is, and I'm curious. Yeah, okay, that's what I thought it was going to be. Cool. Cool. All right, so what the heck are we doing for hoof? I want to say a horse's hoof. Wow, that creaky wood sound is... That's a hoof? Cool. Oh, wow. That tusk is uh, <laughs> well hidden. Hey, a bolt cutter. Warfire loves those things. Ooh, what do we have here? An interior door in the lodge is... Draped in ice. Pick it. Yeah, pick that pick. Cool, let's go that way. <gasps> uh oh. Things just got real. Oh wow, it's like the live actress is awesome. Look at her lips, they're all purpley blue. For a girl it's frozen stick, yet somehow she clings to life. I've located another missing student. She's almost completely encased in ice, and she too is holding a relic similar to the one in the fishing shack. Like the young man I discovered on the lake, the girl in the bathroom is somehow still alive with some kind of possessed or altered state. They should have believed. Don't let the relics come together. She wants us all to fool her, feel her pain. Clutched inside her icy grasp is a walkie-talkie that occasionally receives distress calls from another party. Unfortunately, the communication is only working in one direction, as the woman on the other end is unable to hear me or incapable of responding. I have a feeling the answer to what is happening in Dire Grove is linked to the woman I'm hearing and the strange artifacts that now Frozen students are holding. I need to find her. Alright, so... Oh, zodiac symbols, cool. Ah, uh, that whispering is kind of funny. I do like her hair though. Uh, Alright, so I think what we'll do here. Oh no. <laughs> I'm going to actually just uh, sort of pause myself and I'll zip through this so you guys will see the uh, sped up version and then I'll be right back once we get close to solving it. Okay, I think we got this. This one didn't take too long. It just took me fumbling around with it at the very beginning. But I think we've got this. Or not. Oh, wow. Okay, so we gotta just watch these two around. So, anyways, uh, I thought I had it, but pretty darn close. So, let's not go 
goes there, and then we should be done now. Now. Yay, we did it. Hey, we got a cube this time. I swear. A relief of a confined young woman lies at the center of the relic. Is she free now? I am the hunter. 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 Yeah, that's not creepy at all. Alright, so we have a fisherman and we have a hunter student. those chills all over my body. Cool. Don't let the relics come together. Whatever you do, don't. I don't know how much longer I can hang on. My name is Allison Sterling and I need help. So Alice is the one on the phone. Or on the I don't know how much longer I can hang on. I don't have much time. I like how you can still hear her, even though it's in the other room. The little touches like that impress me. Alright, so what else do we have here? Get the back up. Oh. So, oh yeah, we gotta get that money out of there. No. You break it here. Chisel it, or whatever, pick it. Alright, fine. Another recently dug hole. Alright, I forgot about this one, okay. Let's go. Typewriter. Trap. Ooh, a crowbar. There are no crowbar for you. Faucet and a Celtic dagger. Trout and a radio. I remember that faucet somewhere. Now, where was it? A fan. Ooh, a lock the icer. We need that big time. Well, I don't know about big time, but <laughs> it seems like we would need something like that. An iron. Maybe that's it there, yeah. Potato and a trout. Yeah, we had the potato last time. We also had this ringer here. So, let's see. An iron, a faucet, and a... Is it Celtic or Celtic? Either way. Yeah, I remember had we had this ribbon too. So we need a dagger. There we go. So an iron, a faucet, and a trout. A trout is a fish. Correct? I know I'm asking silly questions, but sometimes they uh, like to play with the English language here. Uh, where is it? I can't find it. Oh shoot, I just saw it right after I clicked it. Arrgh! Now I gotta find a trout. Okay, so when you guys are on your last item, what is your strategy? I don't know, I tend to... Search and destroy here. There's a little bit of logic here. There we go. Not necessarily total logic. Our stuff is... Alright, so now we're on the next page. A 
de-ice sprayer. Hmm. So we still need to figure out that. Where was that lock? Oh, it was way back. Yeah, I remember now. Way back yonder. Bolt cutters! Historical museum, yay! Ooh, and a cassette. Ooh, what's this? Fire extinguisher rests behind a dusty pane. Plane? Pane of glass. Yeah, you're mine. Oh, what do we have here? History? <laughs> Is he gonna break? It looks like he's gonna break. Oh, what's this? There's numbers sketched there. Three, seven. Ooh, somebody stole, took something. Somebody stole something. A display case. The housing that recently unearthed. That relic had been broken into. It's definitely a morphing object. Oh, boy. What are we doing here? Help me out here. I don't want to skip the puzzle, but what are we doing? Oh, good grief. <laughs> okay, we'll come back to that. I don't think we need to get in there right away. I wanted to click on that first. Close for the season. Hmm. The Legend of Lies, a skeptical analysis disproving the legend of Dire Grove. Interesting. Uh, on the eve of All Hallows, when the boundary was thin, four Celts brought gifts to converse with Ma's kin. When tributes was offered and the chants were spoken, the spirits heard knocking and the boundary was broken. The fisher and the farmer with the hunter and the smith watched the cold and the portal shape their world frozen stiff. Okay, so basically we found the fisher and the hunter. We need to find the farmer and the smith. And the candy. Packed with fear from their lands, icy fate. They abducted the alas, a sacrifice to the gate. Their magic was used just one final day. They fashioned four keys to hide the secret away. Some say her carol is naughty but lore. The banshee marks time to freeze our world once more. Candies! Oh, I totally want to get into the candy section here. Ooh, a nutcracker. Oh, I guess there's more toys than candies. Teeth. Stop which boat in a goblet. is a, a gourd. Is that how you say that? Gourd? A toad and a deer. No, a deer. Female deer. A coin and a spool. Hmm. Oh, that's a coconut, maybe? Some sort of vegetable for the other one. Hey, it's a penguin! It's a happy penguin, too! Oh, 
I see nothing. How am I not seeing this boat? Oh, wow. Okay, I had no idea what that was. <laughs> Alright, boat. Where the heck are you? Where are you hiding from me? Seriously. Come on, I want to get it before the indicator adds up. Focus, focus. Oh, maybe we'll get the lighter, I don't know. Is it obvious? Uh, I guess I kind of clicked on that a couple times, so... Yeah, we got some money. 50 pence. Alright, well, I'm going to go ahead and hit the crime computer before I get a mutiny on my hands. I came all this way. When are you going to tell us about this mysterious legend? Well, it just so happens that I have my slides from my lecture right here. Roughly 2,000 years ago, on this very spot, lived an ancient civilization called the Celts. What is now Dyer Grove was once the settlement of Galen. Should we be taking notes? Four Celts. A hunter, a blacksmith, a farmer, and a fisherman. All gathered in Galen and successfully contacted their deceased ancestors by performing the ceremony with these four magical objects. Unfortunately, a gate was opened between the warm green land of the living and the icy void of the dead. Hold me. <laughs> Not knowing how to close the gates, the Celts watched in horror as the icy land of the dead crept into their world. But they realized if they didn't stop the ice, it would overtake the whole earth. So they had to close the gate. They abducted this young woman and thrust her like a sacrifice into the portal. It worked. The ice receded, the earth was green and warm. The Celts collected those magic objects and hid them in different places so that they would never be united again. And what happened to the girl? Well, some people call her the Banshee. Other people call her the Ice Lady. Supposedly, she waits for the discovery of the relics so that she can come back and turn the earth to ice. So that we all may feel her pain. A few days ago, archaeologists unearthed a relic near Dyer Grove that Alice... You believe is one of the four devices used to open a gate to another world. Right. And so do I. I also believe that as well. Do you believe it? That's pretty awesome. All right, so we have uh, six board videotapes to go. So that's cool. 